Well, I think, I think number one, you've, you've got to – punt returning takes a knack. It's a, it is a skill. And I think I mentioned that to you guys early on that he's a natural catching the ball. Okay, once you get through that part of this game, then you've got a chance to become a returner because it's like night and day just catching it. And the, the separation when you catch it between this league and college is night and day. So I've been pleased with his ability to catch it, secure it, make sure we still have the ball. Once, then, then he's just got to grow. He's got to now, now – now he's got to get used to how quickly they're on top of him, and that doesn't happen overnight. So I, I think that's been a huge positive. And, you know, if you look in you – know, we, we looked around the league last year, and there was, there was another team in this league who's primary punt returner and became an outstanding kick returner, didn't return kicks early in the year. And I think you got to be good at one before you're good at two. And I want to give him a chance to get comfortable as a punt returner before we ask him to be the kick returner. And that, so there is a, there's a plan and a process, and then I think you, then you try to speed up the learning curve as the season goes along. But I, I've been, uh, I'm, I'm excited about what I've seen, his ability to catch different types of punts, make sure we get the ball. And then now he's just got to grow and then start to learn what to do with it and make the natural adjustment.